And developing tonight, a multi-state salmonella outbreak affecting most of the country. The Centers for Disease Control is still working to identify the source. No deaths have been reported so far, but more than 100 people have been sent to the hospital. News Nation correspondent Tom Negevin has been working the story from our New York bureau. He's live with what we're learning tonight. Tom. You know quite a bit, actually, Ruth. Really. The CDC says the number of confirmed cases continues to climb across the country and has been for months across a large portion of the country. In fact, most of it. A total of 592 cases reported so far across 36 states. And experts say the actual total is likely a lot higher than what they know because so many people get sick, hunker down, hydrate, get better, and don't call their health care professional or pr report it. So uh, for the same reason, they actually believe this outbreak may be spreading across more than the 36 states they've confirmed thus far. The worst affected, seeing a lot of cases, Texas 149, Oklahoma 92, Virginia 54, according to the CDC, um, at least 116 people hospitalized so far. But again, they're saying that number likely higher. The symptoms, as they know, can be pretty severe diarrhea, nausea, very, very high fever. Some people reporting temperatures of up to 102 degrees. The youngest victim of this outbreak, one, the oldest, 97 from what we have so far. If you have the symptoms, uh, the one thing the CDC points out, it's important to act right away, to get in touch with your healthcare professional, but also to get in touch with them and report what you're experiencing, because that is how they will ultimately triangulate the cases and pin down the source of this salmonella outbreak. The CDC says it's vital to do that to help other people. Again, no deaths thus far. They're working to keep it that way, but over 100 hospitalizations. And the risk here, Ruta Bay, is what we don't know. They still don't know the source. As far as pinning it down, the CDC says they're working on it.